Hey everyone, it's Joe. Welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new here. I create videos about journaling, planning, design, stationery, and whatnot. So uh, let's get started. Today we are setting up my, I guess, travel journaling kit because I am headed to my hometown of Vancouver. So excited. Um, in a few weeks, actually, by the time you're watching this, I'm actually probably on an airplane right now. Um, and this is the kit that I want to bring, the Delphonics um, medium pouch. This fits a traveler's notebook and meant a lot, actually. I've traveled with this pouch many times and it has served me so well in my travels. So I'm going to use that. And I also want to be mindful that I do have um, the luxury of coming home to so much stationery, like a bunch of my stationery, actually almost all of my stationery is in Canada. So I don't need to pack much, but I do want to pack the essentials. And I also want to pack my uh, kit of December daily things that, you know, I've been using for the month. So if you watch my December daily video, you've probably seen my kit already, but um, we'll talk about the contents that's already in here. But I have three other things I need to keep in mind of because a lot of my day-to-day -day writing tools I did bring to um, California with me. And so we need to kind of bring that when I go over to uh, Vancouver. So I have this um, Penko storage caddy from High Tide. Um, that has all of my essential things that I use on a day-to-day -day journaling basis. Um, this lives on my desk, and so we need to kind of bring some stuff from here. This is my current pencil case um, that is chunky. It's really heavy, actually. Um, but I bring this to work. It has, like, everything that I need for, like, possible creative journaling slash like any sort of writing there's like paints in here and whatnot so actually there was paints in here but um i think i want to bring some stuff from here but also downsize to my delphonics pouch which actually is the thinner version of this also by the time you're watching this i don't know if it went on sale but there's a delphonics pouch like this oh sorry not delphonics Euroliku pouch that is the same um dimensions as this classic-y, not classic -y, superior labor utility case, and it's very pretty, so I don't know. Go check that out. I'll see if it's up for sale, but let's, let's kind of work through that and merge a few things so everything can fit in here, and we'll take some supplies from here, and then um, this is the existing kit, so I'll give you a quick rundown of what's in here. So I already have my base uh, markers that I need, I have these top thicker ones are actually um, my paint marker of choice, the Uni Posca. I have the pink and green mild liners. I have one dot marker from Zig. And then I have the chestnut color, the red and the green of the Pentel Touch sign pens. Um, I have the two um, uh, Everyday Explorers co-sets. This is the great indoors and world traveler this one's a collaboration with abby c my friend my bestie and then with that in terms of stamping supplies actually i know this is in my kit but i should i bring these i i have stamp ink there i actually might not bring these because i want to bring stationery back and so i won't bring these actually i'll take them out right before i fly because this is my december daily kit but these are Sachihara ink pads, super good. And then I have my ink pad, so I still need that in there. And then with these washies, I'm going to sample these out before I leave. Um, but these are the washies that I have. Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> these are the washies that I have. And also, um, I have this too, my PET tapes, that, which are, again, still... Um, uh, on pre-order on my Etsy store. Um, I would love it if you could check it out and support it. There's already multiple videos about me mentioning this, but collage, film, <laughs> my hands are so full, <laughs> and then another collage washi tape, not PET tape. But um, yeah, I'm gonna bring, I think I'm gonna bring the full roll of this and then sample the rest of these out. Um, I have my 
date stamp. I think someone asked where I bought this. I didn't buy this actually, and it's not for sale on anyone's online shop. But this is was purchased at a local German store by my friend Abby, um, who makes this, designed this. Um, but yeah, you, you can't find this, I think, online anywhere. So I apologize. Apologize for that, but you can find a bunch of these tearaway calendars now um, in like Yoseka and other stationery stores. I have my dot stickers or donut stickers. And then I have my curated, um, oh, and I have my dot stickers here. Those are both from Classic E. And then these are my curated stickers for this um, December daily, which I've shown in my kit already. And then this flyer that has holiday stuff. Um, and also this scale and leather pouch with scrap papers, but we're gonna, we have our base here. I think for the purposes of this packing video, I'm gonna keep everything inside because I'm gonna throw this in my backpack and anything that goes in here usually flies out, but there's interior pockets in this, which I like. Um, so let's move that in here and then I'm gonna bring this travel palette from PRC USA. Um, I'll leave the link for this down below because this is like, I think our last time carrying this collaboration with our toolkit. So run, don't walk if you need it. I have the pocket one too, the smaller one. Okay, let's, I don't wanna get too overwhelmed, but let's bring, I need a watercolor brush for sure Z. So let's do that first so we need this and I know I have watercolor brushes in here somewhere hehe <laughs> I'm gonna just bring one because I tend to be overboard and bring like multiple yeah this one I'm gonna fill this up actually um, I'm gonna put that in there and then should I bring this tiny glue stick or do I have glue at home that's my biggest no, I have glue at home. I have glue at home. <laughs> um, so that's what I need in there. I'm going to bring... I plan with this a lot. So this beige mod liner. Oh, we're getting a little chonky. Um, and, oh. I have to bring my uni pin. The best fine liner. If you don't have the Sakura Pigma Microns. And then, ooh, it's getting chonky. Um, Pentel for the Nosecape brush pen. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Is it not gonna fit? Okay. That's fine. Oh yeah, we have this. We have this. I think that's all I need. Um, I'm gonna bring, I'm not gonna bring any of these clips. Because I have a giant clip collection in Canada. I think that does it for this. Um, oh, I do like this a lot. I'll, I'll bring this. I'll bring my date. Oh no, I'm going to use my... No, I'm not using this. I have my Joe Big Curry and my, um, my December Daily Calendar. No, we're not going to need that. Um, and then scissors I have in Canada brass no i don't need that okay that's good um and then i definitely don't have any adhesives at home because i brought everything with me and i have scissors at home and i have white out at home so we're good with that i do kind of want to bring a pencil honestly so let's see what's in here i have multiple adhesives in here <laughs> oh oh okay I can't believe I brought this back with me. There's, this, uh, this needs a refill. Okay, I think I'm gonna do... Should I just keep whatever's in here, actually? Yeah, okay, wait, wait, wait. This already has great stuff in here. Yeah, okay, wait, wait. Okay, so, um, you can't really see, but I have a Tombow Fininoski. I have brought both the, the soft and the Hard tip, I have the plotter pencil. Guys, this is so luxurious. So pretty. Um, and then, uh, Sarasa Nano. Do I wanna bring this? Uh, I don't think I'm gonna bring this one actually. 
Um, this ruler is nice. This is like a standard one. It's just flat and nice to bring. Um, and then I do want to bring a pencil. So let's grab a pencil from here. Okay. Oh wait, I have a pencil. The plotter pencil. Doi. <laughs> um. Uni pin. Oh, I need a uni jet stream in here. Wait. Do I have an extra uni jet stream in here? Ah, oh, there's no uni jet stream. Okay, I will make a mental note that I need to bring one. I think that's it. Let's just put... I'm gonna bring this adhesive with me. I don't wanna bring too much. That's my my problem. I I have stationery um, in Canada. So I gotta be mindful. Maybe we'll bring... Um, mm, do I need scissors? Oh, the glue. I think I want to do... I, I don't think I have a glue stick. I'm going to bring this tiny one. This is just a tiny one. Anyways. So all of my adhesives are in here. I'm not going to bring the refill just because that feels silly. Um, and I don't, I'm not going to bring my chalk marker. But I do want to bring this to work. So <laughs> I'll leave that there. Sarasa Nano. I think maybe I will bring it actually I'm gonna pause and grab a uni jet stream one one second okay I'm back I have a uni jet stream this is the limited edition purple lavender one and then we might have to kick this ruler this eraser to this side uh, because I want to bring one fountain pen I was gonna bring uh, a three pen um, case, but I think for, um, my time there, I know I'm gonna have a lot of time there, but I have a bunch of fountain pens there that I can ink and, um, you know, use my inks down back at home. So I'm gonna not bring any, um, and that's a wonderful opportunity to bring something back here. <laughs> so I'm gonna bring a very festive pen. This is my, oh, what is this called again? Sailor Christmas pudding pen from last year it's so festive it's like green and red and dark brown and i have this rickshaw one pen sleeve i think this is the small size or the medium size um and i'm just gonna keep that in there but it's oh no it's yeah that's just right it's snug but it feels good and it's not too too bad actually um actually you know what i'm gonna throw one of the stamp the red one is too good and I don't have a red stamp pad in uh, in Canada. So we're going to do that. We're going to bring the red stamp pad in there. Okay. So let's see. We have that. Um, we're not bringing the nano. We're not bringing the green. We are bringing the paint pad. Um, this is going to stay behind as well and then let's see i think that might be it so everything in here we've already talked about even the stamp pad and the, the ink pad and the tearaway calendar sheet um we are gonna place that in here um and then this in here actually i wonder if this will all fit Oh, it totally fits. And with room to spare. Yeah, that's a totally doable travel kit. Um, is there anything in the back here? I'm feeling some sort of lumps. Let's just double check what that might be. Oh, that's just my pencil case. And then... These washies do fit. So I think... I am gonna just bring that with me. Yeah, perfect, and room to spare. And I, once I get to Canada, I can put the pens that I use the most in here, and it'll feel like a nice, um, full, compact,
system that I can keep on my desk and have my most used items here. Um, the only thing I don't have is I don't have scissors and oh, I do have a glue in here. So I, have, I just don't have my scissors and I don't have my traveler's notebook in here, but I don't like to keep my traveler's notebook inside my Delphonics because that's where I keep my passport. And so it's nice to have that um, elsewhere. But let me grab my traveler's notebook just so you get the full idea. Okay, that is my travel journal kit. It's, I would say, pretty compact. And I'm going to be in Vancouver for almost a month, actually. So you, I do need quite a bit of stuff. And I think this is a nice medium of having my December daily kit with me, as well as having my most used supplies, but also not bringing too much because I have other stationery there. Some people might think, you know, I don't need, need even need to bring any of this stuff, but... Uh, since I have stationery at home, but I did bring you know quite a you know big chunk of my stuff here And so it's nice to have the stuff that you regularly use with you and you can supplement it with the supplies that are there So that is my kit very similar to my day-to-day -day work um, things that I bring it's just a little bit more ephemera and Stationery centric usually I bring this which is pretty much a quarter no a maybe a third or two thirds of the size of this. Um, so I think it's a happy, a happy medium, I think. But that concludes um, my travel journal kit and my December daily kit all in one and also my travel journal. So um, let me know if you have any comments in the uh, comments below or questions about anything mentioned. And let me know what your three must haves are for um, your travel journaling kit. What are the three things you absolutely need? Um, I'd love to know and if you made it to the end of this video Leave an airplane emoji to know that you're part of the end of video gang Thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel I think the next video that you're gonna see here is either my 2024 techo kaigi or some sort of December daily update as we draw closer to um, Christmas and my birthday, so um We'll see what's up on the channel then. Um, until then, please take care and be safe. And again, the holidays are such a mixed bag of emotions for a lot of people. Sometimes it's a really happy time. Sometimes it's a really difficult time for others. So um, if you are people that fall into the second half of what I just said, I hope you're taking care of yourself and finding a support network that you can cling on to and um, get support from because this is a difficult time. If you ever need to message anyone, let me know because I'm happy to extend a warm hand or a hug, a virtual hug obviously, um, because again, these times are tough for some people and I want to be mindful for that. But I love December and I hope, you know, some of that holiday joy is kind of emanating through the screen and um, I hope you feel happy or inspired to do some journaling or something creative during the holiday season. Okay, that does it for today. I've rambled for too long. I will see you in the next one. I love you so much. Take care, my friends. And I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.